Hi friends, greeting from Kingsley the trainer. Hope you're all doing good. When you take the International English Language Testing System exam for writing, you have two tasks. So I'm going to help you how to answer the question, a particular question in relation to task two of writing. The question type is whether you agree or you disagree. So come join with me. Now look at the question. Some people say that in all levels of education, from primary schools to universities, too much time is spent on learning facts and not enough on learning practical skills. Do you agree or disagree? Yes or no? So I'm going to say I'm agreeing. So you have to give reasons for your answer and include any relevant examples from your own knowledge or experience. See, they are asking you to include any relevant examples from your own knowledge or experience. You have done your primary education where you're really able to understand everything there. Then you went on with your high school. Then you went on with your college, university. So what happened there in all these places? Give some examples. Write at least 250 words. Don't write below 250 words. So how are you going to write the introduction? First, you need to write the thesis statement. Paraphrase the question. It is a common fact that too much of time is spent on the classroom and not much of emphasis is given for practical knowledge. In this essay, we shall see as to how this is being done with examples and how it can be overcome, as I agree that not much of time is spent on developing practical skills. And moving on to the body paragraph one, right from pre-KG until college education, we see that more of blackboard classes are being taken and real-time experience is not given to the students. A picture of the apple is shown, but encouragement to give the apple to the child in the class and eat it and help it to understand it is not being done. This is the real scenario in my country where there are good teachers, but due to lack of funding and non-existence of infrastructure, the child has to make its way to understand everything by itself. So creativity is not there. And therefore, the child is just a bookworm. So that is one of the reasons which I'm highlighting in body paragraph one as to why I'm agreeing on the particular topic, on the particular question. Moving on to body paragraph two. See, I've also given how many words I've written for body paragraph one and two. To ensure that you write 250 words. Additionally, using a linking word here, as we enter into college life, particularly for arts and science students, Practical sessions are totally missing, and when they go out to meet the industry, there is always a large gap. The basic computing skills and the skills needed by the industry, especially communication skills, selling skills, computer skills, leadership skills are not given at the university level. More workshops has to be collected, and industry and university relationships and collaboration has to be strengthened. So the total words written here is 76. So moving on to the final conclusion. Finally, to conclude, I would like to reiterate the point that in all levels of education, from primary schools to universities, too much time is spent on learning facts and not enough on learning practical skills, and hence this needs to be curbed to bridge the gap between the requirements and schooling. So overall, I've written about 250 words. This is a simple answer. At least achieve a band 7. So, dear friends, thanks for watching this video. This is Kingsley, the trainer, signing off. Please subscribe to Emmanuel's Up to watch more programs each and every day. Thank you. Have a great day. Thank you. Bye-bye.